Cuba's Finlay Vaccine Institute and Iran's Pasteur Center recently signed a cooperation deal in Havana to push the Cuban vaccine Soberana 02 to phase three human trials. It's already taking place in Iran and it will start here in the next few weeks, involving around 150,000 people. During a ceremony, Iranian authorities expressed satisfaction with the deal. There is good bilateral cooperation between our center and the Finlay Vaccine Institute, which we see as a second home for us. The Cuban side thanked Iran for being the first nation to sign the technology transfer agreement. We are happy to have reached this first accord with Iran for our vaccine Soberana 2, which gives continuity to our historic relations. Last December, Cuban authorities said that phase three trials for the vaccine would also take place in other countries, since the low prevalence of the virus here might not yield desired results. The spokesman for Iran's COVID-19 committee, Kianus Chahampur, tweeted the agreement is part of his country's strategic alliance with Cuba. Since the establishment of full diplomatic relations back in 1979, Havana and Tehran have maintained close commercial and cooperation links while sharing strong political stances against sanctions imposed on both countries by Washington. Cuba backs Iran's peaceful nuclear energy program and Iran supports the island against the six-decade U.S. comprehensive trade embargo. If the Cuban vaccine passes the last trial, it will translate into a political and scientific success, with Iran, Cuba and other underdeveloped nations benefiting from the product, and the island turning into the first country in Latin America to have developed a vaccine against the COVID-19 pandemic.